Hey, you're watching Good Creative Tutorial. Go ahead and hit the subscribe button at the top of the video if you want to learn more about Adobe Illustrator, InDesign, and Photoshop. And uh, this one's on Adobe Illustrator in the series on uh, various special effects. And today I'm going to show you a really quick, simple technique to create a radial pattern. These are some example ones that you might come up with. So go ahead and open up Adobe Illustrator. Go to File New and then choose the polygon tool on the toolbar. You have to click and hold onto the rectangle tool and then drag down to polygon tool like that. Alright, now click and drag and it might be by default, you know, a pentagon or a hexagon. Just press down on the keyboard a couple times until you get a rectangle like so. Alright, just click and drag that out. Alright, now Go ahead and set the stroke here to none. So click there and then click right below it and set to none. And then the color, um, it doesn't really matter. I mean, you can choose whichever color fits the project, but I'm just going to make a little blue there. And this is what you do. Select the Rotate tool and hold down Alt on the PC or Option on the Mac. And just click right here on the anchor point. And keep this set to 80 degrees and just click Copy. Then, without deselecting, just immediately go to Control D on the PC or Command D on the Mac. All right, and just keep doing that until it rotates about twice around the edges, like so. And then you have a pattern like this. There's only a couple more steps. If you click and drag around it with the black selection tool, go to Window and then Pathfinder. You could select the first option here, Unite, and that would just make it one shape. Uh, but for this one, I'm actually going to click the first Pathfinder option. It's called Divide. All right. Then go to Object, Ungroup. Now with that white direct selection, you can choose uh, whichever shapes you want to delete. So uh, let's say with this one, I'm going to Click that one and hold down Control, or actually, I'm sorry, sorry, Shift, and you can select all these if you want. And we could delete them, or actually, we could just move them over um, if you want. It just depends on what kind of radio pattern you're looking for. And uh, I'm going to actually choose the black once I move that over. The selection tool there. And it moves it around as an on pole object itself. All right, so there's the two patterns that you get out of that technique. Of course, you could also have ones with the added rectangle or uh, triangles on the edges there. So a bunch of different looks there, but basically we're just rotating and uh, copying it as we rotate, and then using some Pathfinder tools, and then choosing specific parts of that shape to include in the final look. Alright, so that's creating a simple radial pattern in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks!